You know San Miguel? It's in Mexico. We should go to South. There is an Emporium over there. Maybe we can make some provision. Stella, tell me, why did Petrarch eat that boy? Well, he was normal. What do you mean? He didn't know how to speak to people and then he was also violent. 
In short, he was a moron. A fucking moron, huh? And where did your slutty friend kill him? He threatened to kill her if she didn't go to bed with him. Why didn't she go to bed with him? Didn't he have the money to pay her? No, he had the money. Only that none of us liked to go to bed with him. Even you didn't like to, Stella? No, sir. How did she kill him? She bit off his ear and then she stabbed him. Where and how did she stab him? With a dozen woods of steps to the belly. Do you know this Petra well? Hmm? Where do you think I should go to find her? I don't know, sir. She only came here into town recently. She comes from Mexico, from San Miguel. I think. Do you think so or are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Well, San Miguel. Please take a seat. I'll bring it to you right away. Your turn now. Cut off her hair. Why did you save me? I don't know. Where are you from? Sweetwater. There is a railroad over there. I can read your palm if you want. My mother told me.
you have a, a really long life and you're lucky. Fine. Enjoy your meal. Gentlemen, lady, good morning. Can we join you? Well, I guess silence means yes. finished our hunting. There's not much to hunt around here. We are hunter. Vampire hunters. Sit down and put your hands on the table. Gentlemen, please. The county sheriff often comes here for lunch. Don't be foolish. What's your name? Pedro. And did he do this to you? You don't believe in vampires, right? No. These monsters often hide themselves in guise of beautiful and young girls, just like this one. And what do you do when you catch these vampires? We kill them. And then we cut their heads off. You're crazy. Choose their pride during the day. Then, when night comes, they devour them. You can kill only during the day. At night, they are too powerful for our guns. And someone pays you for this? We do it for the Lord. He will pay for us one day. Fine. Now, the young lady come with us. Come on, get up here. Leave her alone! <laughs> Don't you understand that I am doing this for you too? This poster will suck on your blood 
until she kills you. You can do anything to save yourself. I'm still trembling. Do you believe in that story? The vampire story? No. Well, according to those crazy guys, now I should be turning a bloodthirsty vampire. And by your neck. Finally smile. I don't even know your name. Joe. Can I get closer, Joe? I didn't say thanks for what you did for me. Stand up with your hands in plain sight.
I am Sheriff McNally, and I declare you under arrest for the murder of Tyler and Frank Foreman, and of all the other men that you have left behind you during your ride on this lousy day. It's better you leave now. What the fuck did you say? It's better you leave now. Get dressed, whore. 